a clear bottle, funnel, baking soda, and vinegar. First, we need to put baking soda inside the balloon. You can use a funnel in doing this step. You can put around 4 to 5 spoons of baking soda or until the balloon is full. Use a funnel and pour your vinegar inside the bottle. I used around 150 ml of vinegar. Next, step 3. Stretch the opening of the balloon and attach it to the mouth of the bottle. Next, when you are ready to see the chemical reaction, pour the baking soda into the bottle. between baking soda and vinegar is called acid-base reaction. The reaction causes the baking soda to transform into water and carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide gives a bubbling effect and expands and will blow up the balloons. 